Hey guys, what's going on? We got Black Widow Stage 3 helping me out. We're going to tear down the E46. We're going to get started. Um, today is just going to be tearing down the engine, the harness, getting everything ready to head, pull the head um, and pull the engine as a whole. He's getting me some light. But I'm going to prop up the camera. I'm going to do uh, a time lapse and then just say what I did. Um, occasionally stopping and just showing you certain things. But um, to start off, I mean, it's, it's kind of hard to see, but... <laughs> it's kind of hard to see, but I've done everything in this engine to make taking the engine out really, really easy. So the first thing I'm going to be tackling is uh, taking the whole engine harness and um, pretty much slapping it over so that the engine will be ready for that. Um, just disconnecting the O2s, taking the exhaust off, um, all the little shit. So I'm going to prop it up. Thank you for the help. Black Widow, stage three. Go check them out. I pinned out one of the wires. What I ended up doing is taking an auto, um, one of the uh, wires off transmission computer, and I put it into the pin for a clutch switch because we're going to be wiring this in for two step later on. I'll have a video on that because um, there is ignition cut two step coming for MS43 very soon. Uh, right now, I just have it set to go full throttle um, to test it. There, I had a, I had mentioned it before in a video, but it's going to be very aggressive after they tweak it because I sent the development team a log um, or more so my tuner took my log and sent it to them and uh, this one's being weird. There. and uh, they're gonna try and make it more aggressive because it wasn't shooting flames so that'll help with launching drag racing because uh, it will build boost so shooting flames makes drag racing better no because it'll build boost on a launch Oh. You, can't build you just said shooting flames and then we'll help you with and drag then it racing. will also help with drag racing because we'll be able to build boost from a so, standstill so so you're telling me that if you can shoot flames you'll be winning drag racing yeah yes okay. exactly We got some little stuff to snip, snip and dip. A lot of zip ties to snip. <laughs> yo, 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 yo. Professional zip tie remover right here. Your little boys. You break it. So when are you gonna be ready to take down? Not take down, but take apart fucking the Roush. Whenever you're ready, you're being a bitch about the cold right now. Well, I'll be in a garage. <laughs> With heat? Uh, I don't have caps for the O2, so I almost want to keep them in the exhaust or in the housing. I thought you were taking the exhaust apart. I'm going to take it off. Okay, I'll just take it off now. I'm going to snip the snip. Wrong snips. So, all professional like, I did all this. So that O2 is good to go. It's got to come off the engine as well. This one's a little sketchy. Oh, cutting Perfect. So I got away. I'm going to do this because I don't have anything. I'm lazy. Um, is I'm going to throw tape on this one. Tape on this one so I remember. Um, I could figure it out later on very easily. But this is just going to help with... Um, being even more easy. Just when I want to go put it back together, I'll be like, oh yeah, first, first O2. Um, and then the second one goes over there. <laughs> Good to go. Good to go. Um, <laughs> I got that on camera. Next, I'm gonna get 13 mils. Literally any wrench you could ever need. I'm looking for ratcheting 13. 14. <clears throat> 14. 
Vince. Oh, that's the wrong way, buddy. Uh, yep, you're tightening it. Good to know that shit was loose. <laughs> so that bitch was I definitely had some leaks Looked pretty mint to me It wasn't all the way tight Oh I know, I'm just saying Oh you're being pretty... sarcastic Yeah <laughs> So what I'm <laughs> What I'm doing now is I'm taking the intake housing off um, For like better terms that can come to my head right now Took part of the intercooler piping off saw um i got pretty much the entire engine harness off uh, it's been a while so i'm kind of blanking on some stuff but the plan right now i'll take the intake housing off i got all the exhaust housing bolts out except for one once i get that last one out i can pull the core and then i can take out the uh drain because the drain's kind of a pain to reach um so i feel this will be an easier way um i want to take all this off anyway because i'm going to leave the exhaust housing because i don't like getting to these bolts um, so I'm pretty much disassembling everything around it. Okay, look at that. Look at that. Look at that, boy. The back and forth play isn't bad. The up and down is kind of... But that's off. Oily. Um... Bye bye. So what I'm going to do, like I said, every time I take it apart off so I don't lose it, just throw the bolts back in. I should be using AN fittings or AN, uh, AN wrenches. They don't have any. I'll tell you, I have some in my car, but my car's not here right now. No. I just like driving it because they're claiming rain and snow. Look at all that oil. No bueno. And if we ever wondered what the inside of a turbo looks like. Oil. Oil, oil, oil. <laughs> so what are we doing for this part of the motor? I'm gonna take the intake manifold off. Um, take it off. I'm more than likely going to have to. It's great. It's mucho great. What do you do? Nah, I dropped this off. Uh, we're probably gonna. I'm gonna get it started, but we're more than likely gonna have to take off the fuel rail. Just fine. Um, or yeah. See, You're I so usually, indecisive. I usually don't take the intake manifold off. I usually leave it on when I pull the engine, but the reason I'm taking it off is I want it off anyway, eventually. Right. So I might as well just get, you know what I mean? Right. Get it started right now. Out of handy.
the tech manifold is removed. All the turbo stuff is good to go. That's going to be out of the way, so I don't have to worry about the manifold. The exhaust is good to go when I pull it. Um, the entire wiring harness is good. Um, I have the power ground off from the chassis. I'm going to be pulling it with the harness. Take a bunch of pictures because last time it was a, I had never done a swap, so it was a really big pain to find what uh, plugs went where. And like I said, I'm going to be trying to gut the harness down to bare minimum, uh, deep in the DME. Um, what I'm going to do next tomorrow is I'm going to take the front end off, take the cooling system, um, drain the coolant, and then the next thing after that would be drivetrain. After I get the drivetrain out, or disconnect, so the drive line disconnected, which is going to be drive shaft. I'm going to be removing the diff. I'm pretty much going to take everything diff forward out, uh, diff to transmission, and then I'm going to be pulling the engine and transmission um, sometime this week whenever I can grab the lift. I mean, I have the truck bed cleared out so I can go get it, but um, it's a matter of i got to clear out my garage because my association doesn't allow this particularly. I'm throwing my hood on, but once the engine's out, um, big no-no, lots of fines, $100 a week because I have no engine. 5%. Oh, and camera set. Anyways, make it short. Hope you enjoyed. Um, it's going to be just one long video. Uh, if you guys like it, you like it. Also, thank you for watching through the end because I'm really close to monetization and a lot of cool stuff comes with that. I'm 3,700 watch hours out of 4,000. 1,000 subscribers. Um, I got to make a special video for that too. It's going to be fun, but nothing exciting is going on. So 2%. I'll see you guys in the next one. Shout out to Black Widow Stage 3 for coming in clutch with the yeah, video. I said it three times already. And thanks Black Widow Stage 3's girlfriend for letting him use the car. Because it's supposed to snow. That's what she looks like. He's out. I'm out. Peace. I'm going to the gym. And then, and then B is for build music. Do, 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 do.